this cross remains an idol, if this cross remains a symbol, uh, this cross remains a religious sign, it makes no difference to me and to you. But what I'm trying to say is, cross should not be the symbol, cross should be the journey of your life. Amen. Hallelujah. Cross should be the journey of your life, not one survey, not one say year, that what we are remembering this uh, so-called the length of days of 40 days, but cross should be a daily, daily affair in your life. That's the reason the cross is there. I know it's a sign of a Christian uh, uh, community, but what I'm saying is a little deeper this morning. I have been crucified with Christ, and it's no longer I that live it, Christ that live it in me. People of God, this is the words of our great master, our great apostle Paul. You gotta understand the enemy of the cross is no one else but you and me. Amen. Hallelujah. The enemy of the cross is not the devil. The enemy of the cross is not the society, or the enemy of the cross is not the Romans or the Jew. The enemy of the cross is you and me. How could I say that? Because the Bible tells me in Luke chapter 9, 23, if any man will follow after me, let him deny himself and take up his cross. My, my, my point this morning is we don't carry the cross of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Jesus carried the cross and finished the work on the cross of Calvary and it is you and me to take up my cross. I have a cross in my life. And this cross has to be taken on a daily basis, on a regular basis. Am I reaching you now why I am saying cross should not be just a symbol? Because Jesus never said, take up my cross and follow me. Jesus said, take up your cross and follow me. Amen. Hallelujah. Deny yourself. I'll read again in Luke chapter 14, 27. And whoever does not bear his cross. Church, am I reaching you? This is not the cross we are talking 2,000 years ago. We are talking a cross that is before you every day. Amen. Hallelujah. His cross. Take up your cross and follow me. And cross always means death to self. Death to self. When Jesus was on the cross of uh, uh, on the cross of Calvary, it was death to the body of Jesus. Am I right? Uh, Listen, because we got to go a little deeper. It's not death to the soul. It's not death to the spirit. Cross is death to the body. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. It's a revelation. As much as Jesus bore the cross, you and me have to bear the cross because through the cross, we are putting body to death. Amen. Hallelujah. Am I clear? Yeah. Cross is to kill the body, not your soul and the spirit. May God, praise God for that. And cross would not kill Jesus' spirit. Cross would only kill the body of Jesus because God's body needed by the community or by the humanity. Amen. Hallelujah. And the same tone I wanted to tell you this morning. I have a cross in my life and you have a cross in your life and to carry the cross you've got to understand you have to deny yourself. I, me, myself. There are three names Jesus was crucified with. Nail in the right hand, nail on the left hand, nail to the feet. Three nails. I call these three nails as three personalities of your life. I, one nail. Me, one nail. 
Myself and other name. Praise God. Amen. Hallelujah. I, me, myself has to be crucified as Jesus crucified on the cross. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. That's what Paul says. I am crucified with Christ. I. It's not somebody else. I carry the cross and buffet my body every day. Amen. Hallelujah. Cross is a journey. Amen. Hallelujah.